Then they'll line it up and do it again. How long is it going to take them to get three wide? I can tell you who I think is going to win this race, but I'm not going to say it. Oh, come on. You got to know. You I, I, I think the 22 is going to win it. I mean, he, the rest of them don't have tires. He's lined up right to back. I mean, what we got? Two, three, two laps to go here? Here we go. Green light checker finish. Brad Keselowski lined up on the outside of row two. Kyle Busch and Justin Allgaier are up front. Busch gets the restart. And here comes Kyle Edwards, three wide to the outside of Keselowski. Greg Biffle. Oh, they're three wide for the lead. Maybe four wide? Where did Biffle come from? And Keselowski threw in the bottom. Here we come into the white. This is the last lap. Biffle leads that one. Keslowski to his inside. Carl Edwards going to be black flag for jumping that last restart. Yeah, he passed before the start finish line. Side by side, final corners. Keslowski's going to squeeze out in front. He dominated, but boy, he had to sweat that one out. Brad Keslowski, back to back wins in the NASCAR Nationwide Series. Unbelievable. I mean, back to back. This team is so strong right now. It's unbelievable. And those four tires are right call. Hand it to Biffle. Where did he come from? <laughs> Holy cow. Man, this is awesome to watch you, Brad. A lot of fun. That's what you pay me to do, RP. We got it done today. Great job. Whoa, you get to get a car to win. What a night for Brad Keselowski. He led 189 of the 252 laps. And Mike, he's picked up a win, but he had to work for it. Yeah, they did. Some anxious moments. What was it like when that caution came out and your big lead went away, Paul Wolf? Well, it definitely wasn't what we wanted to see with the Ruby Tuesday Dodge tonight. We've had a great car all night. And, uh, you know, we kind of figured something like that was going to happen. And, you know, we're kind of sitting duck. Whatever we do, uh, everybody else is going to do the opposite. So uh, we feel like we needed four tires, and I think it paid off. What were those closing laps like for you? Oh, it's just after last week, you know, to get our first win and, and then have some of the controversy around it. It's nice to come back and, and, and do it again tonight. You can sense the sense of vindication, guys, in Paul Wolf's voice. So Brad Keselowski with his eighth NASCAR Nationwide Series win. His first win here at Richmond after finishing fourth in both of last year's races. And the green-white checker finish. Look, there's Greg Biffle inside of row three. Man, where did he come from? <laughs> Inside of row three. Hey, you see how Kyle Busch gets a great start, and Carl Edwards right here is passing before the start finish line. That's where the penalty's coming from. But look at Biffle drive this thing down into turn one. And look how much new tires do. I mean, look at Keselowski carving it through there. Kyle Busch can't get going at all. McMurray can't get going. Definitely the right call. We come back next year and say you think four tires with five laps go will work? 